What's up? Hey guys, it's Ivan. In this video, I want to show you an alternative to creating a video Facebook ad. So I know how some of you may be intimidated in making a video for your Facebook ad, uh, or you just don't want to do it, or it's too lengthy, you don't want to commit. Um, there is an alternative, and that is by making a slideshow. And that's pretty cool because it, it fulfills most of the requirements of a video. It's there, it's active, it's engaging, uh, it, it catches people's attention, right? And it has more kind of to show than a simple uh, image, right? So let me show you how to do that. It's really simple. Uh, I've already downloaded some some sample images actually from the previous video we've made when we, we've made shirts. Uh, so all you need to do is just have some images. That is it, okay? So when you go on your Facebook account at the ad level, let's go to one of the sample campaigns. Now you can't do this for a video views campaign because you need a video. They're not a slideshow. So you can't do it for every type of campaign. Keep that in mind. Um, probably the, the best ones are uh, traffic and uh, conversion ads, right? Uh, which which you can use uh, uh, this, this slideshow for. So let me go on uh, create ad here. Let's go to one of these. Uh, select ad with image or video. And then over here at the bottom, click on video slash slideshow, right? And then say uh, create slideshow. And what you do is you literally just put in the images, okay? So let's put in this image, let's put in this image, let's put in uh, this image and maybe this and this image, okay? So let's just say that. And uh, when you click on play, as you can see, it's going to change. There's going to be one second kind of duration of the image, right? So you can change that as well, maybe make it three seconds and make it make the transition to fade, okay? So you're kind of limited with the options here, but it is there, right? So it, it this, this option is available. So now, it's gonna take three seconds for each video and it's going to fade, okay? So this looks pretty nice. I would probably go with two seconds, um, but it is cool. Now, one thing you should keep in mind when you're doing this is make sure the ratios are the same across all your images. So as you can see here, I believe this one we made, this image was, um, yeah, so, so, so you can edit some stuff here, but I believe this image was 1200 by 1200. So the ratio was one to one here, okay? Um, for the other images, they're not. And as you can see, some of the stuff was left out. It looks awkward, right? It doesn't look consistent. One picture is massive. The other picture is small. It doesn't look consistent. I like consistency. So um, it, it would look better if you make sure that all your images are the same kind of size and the same ratio. Okay, that's the most important thing. Like this image, for instance, uh, this is not a one-to-one -one ratio, I believe. I just took it off online. And this one is definitely not a one-to-one, -one, okay? So make sure all your images uh, maintain the same ratio when you do this. Otherwise, it's going to look awkward. So let's just, uh, let's just take a look real quick. Yeah, so this one, as you can see, everything fits in there. This one, everything fits in there because it's one-to-one, -one, everything else, not so much. This one, maybe a bit, right? Uh, but, but just keep that in mind. So then when you're done, click on Create Slideshow. Put in the URL you want to promote. So let's say a marketingessentials.com again. Uh, and then you would basically do the exact same things you would for any other type of ad. So display link, that's optional. I'm just going to leave that blank for now. Uh, headline, uh, you know, um, get this free... Uh, ebook now, for instance, right? News link description. Uh, have you ever been XXX? Um, see, I can't seem to click enter. Oh, sorry, has to be in text. Okay, wrong one. Okay, so um, sorry for this one. Let's say maybe a uh, hundred percent guaranteed, super good quality. Sorry, for this one, I can click enter. Uh, so that one, let's say, have you ever been XXX? Uh, lucky for you, I have a solution. Maybe check out my store, okay? And what 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 you could actually do here is, um, so, you know, if you're launching T-shirts especially, this is pretty cool because you can have your storefront, okay? Uh, if you haven't set up a storefront, check out that video. Um, I, I, I show you how to do from E to Z. But if you have a storefront, you can display all your different um all your different images here, okay? And that that's pretty cool. That shows people more than just the one image if that's how you want to do it, right? So if you're targeting an audience that may be interested in a variety of different shirts, you can do that here, okay? So you can kind of uh, not put all your eggs in one basket and say, hey, this is the design that's going to sell. Let's try all these different designs. So you can try it. You can try a slideshow. Um, pretty cool, right? More, more options there. So there's that. Make sure you click on track all conversions, right? You want to track conversions. Uh, set up your call to action display link. 
So that's pretty much it. So now what you would do, that, that's the mobile newsfeed. Let's go to desktop newsfeed. So that's what it's going to look like. Okay, right there. So yeah, so as you can see, it's a bit, it's a bit uh, big because the dimensions don't match. So let's just click uh, save and let's see what it's going to look like. So I'll just show you guys for this one. All right, so that one's right there. So let me just show you what it's going to look like now on an actual news feed. So when you go here, right, have you ever been XXX? And then the video starts playing, okay? So it is definitely much more engaging and kind of it, it fills all those requirements that you need for a video uh, without having to be there. Yes, it may not be as effective as you directly speaking to the people, um, but it's there, right? And and it, it captures the people's attention and you may even maybe have some music here as well. Uh, let me just see. Uh, I'm not sure if that would be possible with the, um, let me see, create slideshows. Yeah, so I don't know if you can actually put a uh, put a uh, bit like uh, music here, uh, but but the the video is there, right? And it shows it captures attention and it gets the job done if that's what you want to do. Again, especially useful if you have a storefront. So that's about it. Um, I hope this was beneficial for you guys. Um, you know, if you don't want to do a video, this is an alternative. If you guys have questions, comments, or concerns, let me know. Leave them down below. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. For those of you that have subscribed, thank you. I do appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video.